here's what I mean about effectively utilizing the plane's interior space. Suppose there were six of me lined up to get inside this car. There's regular Brad, pocket pool champion Brad, breaking up with his girlfriend right now Brad, Brad with a crippling sun allergy, Brad the fan of the WNBA's LA Sparks, and Brad doing a totally awesome robot. Now, let's see how long it takes for the six Brads to get into the car. Now, some of you may be wondering, where did we get six Brads? And what do we do with them after the shoot? Well, our This versus That scientists worked hard, cloning Brad in a secret Siberian lab. The six Brads were flown to Los Angeles specifically for this experiment. After the experiment, the six Brads were dismembered and their corpses were buried and, oh, time's up. The six Brads got into the car in 26 seconds. Next, we tried the same experiment again. Only the six Brads got into the car more efficiently. Twelve seconds. When the six Brads can simultaneously utilize more of the car's access points, they all get inside the car faster. In this case, twice as fast. In science, this is known as the Chinese fire drill principle. It's this idea, the idea of simultaneous access, that the more efficient airplane boarding methods utilize most effectively. Let me show you how it's done. <laughs> 